Hello, world, and thank you for returning to another Poet Ray poem. I am, of course, Poet Ray. This here is my good pal Rick Rack, as you may very well know, who is always here to support me as I read my poetry, because it is good to have someone to lean on while you are expressing yourself like that. And, uh, no, you're happy to be here, too? Oh, well, thanks, pal. I could not do this without you. Uh, we've had a pretty good week. We've just been chilling a lot, and it's been really chilly outside. But right now, here we are in our happy place. The nice green forest behind us. The cool, crisp sound of running water. Just kidding. But this is our happy place. Uh, however, we don't stay here all the time, of course, right? There's so much world out there to see and experience. And that kind of brings me around to what today's poem is all about. Uh, so... Without further ado, I'll just read it to you instead of just talking about it more because that's the whole point, right? Right. Okay, so here is my poem titled Window Square. Watching through the window square, lots of life and love out there, lots of hurt and danger too. The world is always after you. Better off to stay inside. Warmth and comfort don't derive. The window square shows quite enough of people out there living tough. Toil, heartache, strangers, risk, anger, judgment, opinions, tisk tisk. The world outside is cold and cruel, the greatest lesson taught in school. So why engage when you can stay behind the window square all day? A voyeur with no stake or loss, a lifetime full of sheen and gloss. Safety's better off than chance, Security's a routine dance. Let them all go have their fun. Don't fret for things you haven't done. Sure, you may miss out a lot, but everything out there is fraught. Life is uncertain. Life isn't fair. Best dare not leave the window square. Thank you. Thank you. Of course, everyone. In case you missed it, I'm being facetious because you can't just sit behind your window square all day, am I right? What kind of a life is that? You won't see anybody, you won't talk to anybody new, you won't get to try the amazing Chinese food from the restaurant down the street unless they have takeout, which case, sure, maybe you can, but it's not the same. You know what I mean? You hear what I'm getting at? You know what I'm getting at. You know what it's like. Did you enjoy looking at the world from your mug every day? No. Is it so much cooler to be here and experience things? With others? Yeah! You said it, pal. You said it. I'm not going to say verbatim what he said because it's probably not appropriate, but, you know, it's the gist and it's the truth, guys. So, here we are, Rick Rack and I, encouraging you to get out there into the world. I know it's extra scary place right now with everything going on. Wear your mask, be safe, wash your hands, but get outside. It is so important. We're not just meant to sit and stare from a window all day, every day, forever. Okay, now I'm leaving a dead horse, and now we are going to say goodbye, have a great week, and we will catch you next week with another poem. Thank you, and good night.